Hey everyone, Roblox Dev here, and today I have a really quick tutorial on print statements. So let's get right into it. So I'm going to go ahead and create a blank base plate and insert a script in server script service or the workspace. Scripts only run when they are parented to workspace and server script service. Uh, so let's go ahead and insert a script in server script service. Always make sure to name your scripts. I'm going to call it print statements. And in here, you, uh, okay, that's my muscle memory uh, to automatically delete that, but I'm going to keep it this time. I'm going to go ahead and play the game. And inside this output window, you'll see that it printed hello world. And uh, why did it do this? Well, it's because we told it to right here. We said print hello world. And uh, don't worry if you have a printer connected. It's not like that. It prints it in the output. So I could change print hello world to uh, something like Roblox dev and hit play. And it will print Roblox dev. So go ahead and customize the message and print something you'd like. And uh, from there, you can go ahead and do some numbers. So these numbers, uh, yeah, they print, and uh, that's pretty much, uh, well, the first part of what I want to show you. So if we get rid of these uh, quotation marks, you'll see that there isn't an error message, and that's because these are counted as integers. Integers are any sort of number. Uh, basically, numbers don't need uh, speech marks around them, especially when you're doing math. So uh, real quick, I shouldn't be teaching you this yet, but if I were to do this number plus 1, it'll print the number plus one. As you can see, there's a five on the end of it because I added one to this. Uh, basically, if I had uh, speech marks or quotation marks around them, it wouldn't exactly uh, work because you can't perform an arithmetic on a string. A string is anything inside speech marks. So uh, an arithmetic is basically math. So you can't add text to text, right? Uh, basically, once they're inside quotation marks, they become text and you can't add text to each other. So uh, okay, so it did work. I never knew that, to be honest, but uh, please never use uh, addition or subtraction or anything with um, uh, strings. You'll likely get an error because, well, you would only use these if you have text. So from there, I want to teach you about Boolean values, which is the last type of value we're going to be talking about today. And that is either uh, true or false. So true, false, you know, simple as can be true and false. You know, true prints true, because, like, true means, like, yes, and, like, we told it to. These, again, don't need speech marks or quotation marks around them. Uh, you can just have them there. So, uh, that's going to be the end of this tutorial. If you guys did enjoy the video, uh, please be sure to hit the subscribe button down below so you don't lose the channel, and you can continue watching these amazing videos, and you can learn how to script and become a pro, a pro Roblox scripter. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video. It's Roblox of Peace.